What's up? Welcome into your daily Buckeye Blitz for a hump day. Wednesday, October 5th, 2022. Is it a dry hump day? Yeah, depends on how you feel, right? All right, getting back into it. I know yesterday we talked about uh, what was wrong with Denzel Burke. So today I want to continue to focus on the defense. Oh, by the way, I'm Joe from the Buckeye, the Buckeye cast. Uh, hit the website. Give me a thumbs up on the video and subscribe to the podcast. All that good stuff. Anyway, uh, I want to continue focusing on defense. Uh, I want to throw some stats at you and I want to show you uh, how I want to contrast 2021 versus 2022's stats and show you some of the important analytics that um, I think really, really show the difference between last year's defense and this year's defense and what Jim Knowles has done in just what he, in six, nine months. I mean, uh, this is week going into week six. So, but starting off with week one, I know you, you can argue that the schedule has been relatively weak this year. I don't know. Last year's was pretty weak and through the first five, six weeks. So um, anyways, what we have here, is, let's see how these going forward. I want to see how these stats change if they get better or worse for this season. But as of right now, I think a five game sample size is pretty good. Um, so here we go. Opponents points per game, 2022, 14.8 points per game. That's 11th in the country. All right. 2021, we allowed 22.8 points per game that was 31st so a change of 20 positions we moved up 20 spots that's substantial obviously um opponent yards per game 263.8 we've allowed that's ninth in the country right now versus 2021 we allowed 374 per game that was 51st so that's over 40 spots we've moved up that's incredible that's huge Yard, I don't need to tell you how important points and yards are, right, per game. Um, points per play. This is one of those more kind of nerdy stat, analytical guide type stats, but I think it's important because it does show a difference. Uh, 0.245, that's 13th right now in 2022. Compared to last year, 0.313, that was 22nd. So a move up of nine slots there. Again, vast improvement. Um, opponent yards per play. This is an important one, too. It's kind of nerdy. But 4.4 yard opponent yards per play. So every play they ran, they gained 4.4 yards so far this year. That's 11th in the country. That's pretty damn good. Uh, last year, we were 5.1. That's 35th. So, again, moving up substantially, not just a few spots, substantial improvement. That's 0.7 yards per play. We've improved. Um, opponent red zone scoring attempts per game. Uh, you might remember last year, once teams got in the red zone, it was basically a given they were going to score. It seemed like they scored a lot of touchdowns, a lot more than a few of us. But anyways, um, this year, 2.0, that's number six in the country, red zone scoring attempts. So the number of times a team is inside the red zone and they have a, a chance at scoring. Uh, last year, they were we were at 3.9, so almost double in scoring attempts inside the red zone. That, that was 39th in the country. So we moved up 33 spots there. Uh, opponent red zone scores per game. So the number of times teams scored, actually, uh, touchdowns and field goals. 1.8 right now. That's number 16 in the country. Last year, we were at 2.8. That was 54th. Wow. That's quite a leap. <laughs> Almost 40 spots. Uh, these two conversion uh, stats are important to me uh, because you need to get your defense off the field. You remember last year, we were freaking garbage at third down, third down conversions on defense. It seemed like every time there was a third down, you could just hand it hand it to them and give them the first down. Uh, so right now this year, we're at 3.8. That's number 16 in the country. I think we should be better there. I think we need to improve there. Uh, 16 is good, but compared to where we were last year, 6.0.
96 in the freaking country. So we moved up 80 spots. That is substantial improvement on a very key stat to me. you got to get your defense off the field. The defense has to get itself off the field, whatever. Um, and then fourth down conversions, 0.4. That's 15th in the country this year compared to last uh, last year, 0.7, that was 27th in the country. So another another improvement there that's good. Uh, we don't see a lot of fourth down attempts against us, uh, at least so far this year. So that's a, a good thing. But um, last one I wanted to point out, and this illustrates the, uh, the, the playbook for opposing teams and how they're, they're attacking the Buckeyes is point, or I mean, I'm sorry, Opponent plays per game, 60.4. So they're right now they're running on average 60 plays a game against us. That's seventh in the country. The, where it ranks really doesn't matter. But last year, they were running 72.8 plays per game against us. So now you're seeing the ball control bleed the clock down inside of 10 seconds when they have the ball, opponents that is. And when the opponent has the ball, they're going to take it all the way down as low as they can and then probably run it, <laughs> you know, uh, like we saw with Rutgers or play quarterback roulette like they did. But anyways, uh, so a substantial difference there. You're, you're talking 13 plays less. So they, the book is out on, on how teams want to attack us and keep the ball away from our offense, you know, which makes sense. I mean, our offense is high flying best in the country. So that's all I got for you today. Hope you enjoyed that breakdown. So substantial improvement. This defense has nowhere. I mean, I, I cannot even explain how much improvement I, we've seen uh, besides guys just playing fast and flying around. I mean, these numbers bear it out. Right. Um, besides all the, you know, the issues with Denzel Burke and, and the injuries and this and that. This is vast improvement in, in just a short time period. So hopefully we continue to improve and I want to see see us in the top 10 in all of these uh, defensive categories. So, so I got for you today. I will talk to you tomorrow. Go Bucks.